Hello again, everyone. It's Vince Ford from TradeWinds.com, and this is our update for June 13th, 2017. Let's take a quick look at today's markets. Well, we saw a decent rally today, especially by some of the big names, which we'll have a look at in just a moment. But the Dow managed to close at record highs. It was up 92 points and hit a new high of 21,287. The S&P 500 up 11 points, while the Nasdaq rallied 45 and the Russell was up about six points or so. So a pretty strong day overall. Bonds were fairly flat. I mean, they were lower. They got back to that 20-period moving average, but did bounce right off it. So this looks looks good. I still think we'll see a rally there in the coming days. Um, gold was lower by about 30 cents at the close. Again, was lower here, but managed to bounce back nicely. We still have nice upward momentum there. Um, let's get to some of those big names, starting with Apple. There's a decent bounce today. It was up a little over a point, while Facebook continued to climb, rallied over two points. Amazon also rallied today nicely. It was up almost 16 points. So can the question is, can they get back to the, their, their highs here? I, I think not only can they, uh, but they can, you know, continue this rally that has been going on all year and push on to new highs. Now, a lot is going to depend on tomorrow. Uh, the Fed rate decision will be out at 2 p.m. Eastern time. Now, there's an 84% chance that they will raise rates. At least that's what the last, or the most recent survey shows us. Um, and question is, <clears throat> can they save the dollar? I mean, Right now, if you look at the dollar index, it really is uh, ha or has become a falling knife type situation. Now, if we look at the weekly chart, there is an area of support here, but it can certainly move down a few more cents here before even testing those areas. So we'll see what the Fed says tomorrow. If they hike, I think the dollar may rally here, um, a much needed rally. Otherwise, uh, if they don't, I think you're going to see a sharp decline in the dollar immediately. So we'll keep an eye on that. It all happens 2 p.m. Eastern tomorrow. That's about it for now. Enjoy the rest of your day, and we will see you on our next update.